The Unity Asset Store is full of amazing tools to create your own games. In this video, I'm going to showcase the top 10 assets for creating realistic visuals in your game. All of the assets are linked in the description in case you want to use them for your own projects. Starting with number 1, the Atmospheric House. This asset can be used for almost any type of game. Horror, puzzle, adventure, you name it. It's simple to use and can easily be changed to create as many variations as you need. There is also a night and day demo scene for you to play around and look how everything was set up. So yeah, great asset, highly recommended. Number two is the mountain environment. Again, this asset can be used for so many different projects. As long as you plan to have just one outdoor scene, this is the best environment pack I found. Also, everything in this pack is optimized and contains LODs for better performance. The next one is another great asset, but I have a disclaimer about it, so wait just a second before you run and buy it. This is the Pro Military Asset, perfect for FPS games. Contains a demo scene, sound effects, VFX, medkit grenades, folding knife, weapons, hands. The asset looks amazing and the animations are also great. The only issue I have with this pack is that the code for this asset is not that good. So if you want it for the animations, the VFX and the models, go ahead and buy it. But fair warning, you may need to code everything yourself and not use their code. Number four is the Dark City 2 pack. This one is pretty simple. If you're aiming to have a cyberpunk city, this is it. I think this is the best cyberpunk environment in the asset store. So yeah, grab this one. Also, it contains LODs for all the assets and it has some modular building elements. Oh, okay, the next one, number five. This is an amazing asset. It's called the Castles and Dungeons RPG Pack, and I don't even need to explain this one. This is just perfect for realistic looking RPGs. And it's modular, so you can easily create a full game using just this pack. It looks amazing, contains over 500 assets inside this pack, already have a demo scene, LODs included. Just get this one, seriously. If I'm making an RPG or maybe even a puzzle game, this asset is Perfect. Next one is number six, and this one is either the oh my god, this is what I'm looking for asset, or the ah, oh, I'm never gonna use this one asset. Kinda depends on what environment you want to build. Either way, this is the destroyed building kit. All of the models are optimized, and this is one of those assets that what you see is what you get. Pretty simple, create any type of destroyed building with this. I can even see this one used for like a crazy parkour game, kinda like Mirror's Edge, but in a destroyed city. So yeah, if you need it, grab it, it's there. Number seven, it's the high quality survival pack. If you're looking to make a survival game, this is it. This is what you need. I think the asset creator was really inspired by games like Rust and The Forest. So if you're looking to make something similar, this is it. Oh, and by the way, this asset price is just $15, which is a joke for what you get. Seriously, 28 weapons, 23 tools, 35 building parts and much much more. Again, if you're making a survival game, this is what you need. Just grab this one and you'll be golden. Number 8 is the Water Shader HDRP. If you're making a game and you need a Water Shader, this is the best one I can find. Yeah, simple as that. It looks great and easy to use, so go ahead and grab this one if you need it. Number 9 is something that you can use for any project. It's the Aura 2 Volumetric Lighting and Fog. I'm sure you've seen this one before, but I couldn't leave it out of this list. Take any game, make it 10 times more atmospheric with this asset. Everything looks amazing. So yeah, if you need it, if you want to make the game look more interesting, just get this asset. It's great and you will use it so many times. And the last one, number 10, if you're making a cooking game or something with a kitchen, this is it. This is all you need. The Kitchen Pops Mega Pack. Sadly, this one contains only pictures, so this is what I can show you, but it contains so many kitchen props, so if you need a fully stacked kitchen, all you need is this one asset. To be honest, this asset is pretty expensive, so if you're looking for something specific, the owner of this asset split it into volumes. So you can just buy parts of what you need and not everything. If you find this video helpful, leave a like, subscribe, and let me know if you want more of those, maybe a top 10 for a fantasy game or something like this. Again, all of the links are in the description, so enjoy whatever you decided to pick up. Thanks for watching, and I will see you all in the next video.